Hi everybody, and today I'm going to show you how to make a duct tape wallet. I do not have an example right now, but I've already somewhat started. Um, first you're going to take, first you're going to have, doesn't matter how many different colors, but um, I'm going to use two, silver, um, and peace sign. It's from my little sister. And then, all you're going to do silver. is take four four pieces of tape about seven inches or I have an eight inch scissors so I just measure it a little bit litter, littler because I do not have a ruler and just cut four strips So do that four times. Um, Facing sticky side up. So after you're done, I'm not the fastest cutter, but four strips. Then you're just going to overlap the sticky side. Basically doing the same exact thing. You do want to make this probably a tad bit longer so you don't make it any shorter. Oops, sorry. Can you waste any sparkle? I don't know, I'll don't. see. I don't want you to see what I'm making, but you can look. Starting now. So just overlap it as many times as needed. And press it down. So make sure you cover up all the stickies, and if you see a little part of sticky, then just cover it up. And then it'll look like this. My wallet. So then you're going to fold it in half, like that. Ooh, Make shiny. sure the crease is like this. And all the sticky stuff will be facing like this. But don't worry. Like this, you'll just trim it off.
like so. You can make it however you want. You can have a little sticking up up here if you want, but you don't have to. Okay, so now you're going to make three strands of tape, about a little longer than your wallet, so about maybe a hand longer. Um, so cut three strands. Do not overlap these. Huh. They don't have to be exactly even because you will again eventually end up cutting it. Sorry, I'm not the best to start this. Sorry, I hit my hand. Are you okay? I work on my tape for my wallet. And L. Um, so then, after you have your three strands, like that. Hopefully you saw that. Um, you're going to take one strand, oops, face it this way, and one C side up, and just... Line it up like that. Seventy-eight. And you can either cut or fold over all the extra. I'm going to do exactly the same for my pattern. Do my pattern. Do you want me to finish? Oh, 
Let's see what I have to do. I'll do my own video. Ben, you're going to take your other one? Oops. Oh, he's there. And you're trying to do it. Then you're going to take your other one? And tear or cut or something in half. Hey, can you put that back on? So then you'll have two strands in half. Can you cut it up? So now you're going to put it on here. Oh, we'll take one half. Place it on there. And fold it over. Can I put a couple of yeah, ones. Where at? Right here? Right here? So just fold it. And cut off all this extra right here. And then you're gonna take your wallet, open it up like that, and find how big you want your pocket, or find wherever you want it. So I'm just gonna take a credit card or a gift card and line it up with a little bit off the edge right there. Right there, you see, a little bit off. And then on the other side, I'm just gonna cut with a little bit extra. And then I don't need that no more, or anymore, I mean. And so then I'm just gonna measure it however many times I feel. So mine is going to have three pockets. One, two, three. That's mine. So then you're going to just cut tape to um keep your bullet down. You could use a different color, but you don't have to. And you could see if your credit card will fit. Mine does not unless you put it that way. Like that. Oh, here we go. I just took off the, I just fold, took off the centerpiece and just folded it down. So now I have my money slot, and I have one credit card holder. Um. So, I'm sorry. So this third pocket is all like this. I'm going to fix that real quick.
by just taking some tape and Like this, okay, soon. Then I'm just going to take my scissors and cut this way, so then there is more room to put the credit card. So then you could test it out. And just to edit it as much as you want. And then you can test out your money. I'm just going to take a one dollar bill. Looks like this. Not the best wallet, but it's still a wallet. And then take it like this and fold it. And then you're going to tape down these sides right here. Hi, this is not the best wall I've ever made, but... And then you could trim it up. Oh, I guess this is a different kind of wallet. Well, this one is like this. Um, so it has a money holder on this side and on this side, whichever you prefer. And then it has one credit card holder, which you can make more, right there, like that. And then again, you can fold it in half and edit it however you want. Thanks for watching. Bye.